At this stage, uh, we'd like to uh, <coughs> allocate the samples. Uh, we typically provide some PCR wells and also uh, some alignment markers. Uh, we have a 10, uh, uh, 20 base pair and also uh, as a lower marker and upper marker of 1000 uh, combination cocktail here which is made by Bioptic and also we provide some uh, DNA ladders or DNA size markers in this case is a PBR322 uh, DNA ladder uh, so basically you would use a, uh, a pipette uh, set at 20 microliters and you would basically allocate in two vials uh, one for the uh, DNA ladder and one for the uh, uh, alignment marker the lower and upper markers so once you allocate the samples in the uh, PCR wells uh, you would basically move the tray uh, toward the uh, again buffer position first <coughs> In this case, I have already allocated the sample, so I will show you uh, which position it goes. So in the buffer position, <coughs> we allocate the uh, uh, alignment marker, which is the uh, 10, uh, the 20, uh, and the uh, 1000 base per cocktail, and it goes to the first uh, position and then the second position uh, could be allocated for the uh, uh, another alignment marker like the 20 uh, base pair and 5000 combination close the door and then uh, rotate to the uh, sample position so at this point of course I'm gonna put the sample in And in this case, I've already chosen uh, A1. So you can see it goes from uh, 1, 0, 1 to 12. Uh, and then this is the A1 on the other direction. So the sample is being loaded on the A1 position. Close the door. And then we go to the next step, uh, which is basically configuring uh, the methods to be run.